Ladies and gentlemen, I kept getting questions about a kid named Kid Austin. Um, I've seen him around on Instagram, stuff like that. I, I, I may have seen one or two of his fights before last night fight on the zone. Um, his name's Floyd Schofield uh, for the guy named Guerrero last night. I mean, a lot of people ask me what I thought about him. Um, you know what I mean? What, where do I think he can go? To, to, to be honest, he needs a lot of work. Uh, he fought a guy who was a bantamweight at best. And and the weigh-ins, they both weighed in at 33 and 34. Uh, Schofield was clearly the bigger guy, um, the stronger guy. The skills are, he, he has some good hand speed, but he don't like to move his head and he don't like to pick his hands back up when he's done. I think up against another prospect, him being 11 and 0 with nine knockouts, I think up against another prospect, he will get hurt simply because he's used to the small plates. And by small plates, I mean by the, the smaller opponents, easier opponents. The guy, the guy was tough. The guy Guerrero was tough, but he wasn't an, enough to keep Schofield off him or to even keep him thinking. I mean, with that being said, he he got caught. Schofield got caught with some short hooks. Things like that. And had he been in there with a bigger guy, I think he would have he would have possibly got hurt. People gonna call me a hater. Some people gonna say, you know what I mean, I'm being negative and you know, I am just talking boxing. And um and from from my knowledge, like I said, in there with another prospect, a kid would get hurt. You know what I mean? I think that kid needs to focus more on his skill set, like I said, rotating his hands, moving his head, you know what I mean? Uh, not crashing in, running in after his punches. Um, I think he should set his punches up a lot more than work his way to the, to the body and back up to the head. You know what I'm saying? Um, and stay off of Instagram. I mean, Insta Instagram is probably the devil right now because, you know what I mean, most people think that they have to be on Instagram promoting themselves and promoting their fights and not focusing on the fights. You know what I'm saying? He's a, he's a young kid. He's only 19 years old. He does have room to grow, but with with them moving him up as fast as they are, I think he needs a lot of work. He needs a lot of work because the 130 pound division and 35 division is very dangerous. It's a lot of work at those weight classes. And um, I don't think he fares up too good against a, an, a, a another prospect or an opponent who's really coming, you know what I mean, to do damage. Uh, but at some time, we're going to have to see it. So again, my... My opinion on the kid, get back in the lab, work on your skills, work on rotating your hands, moving your head, and I think he, he can find some success. Also, don't focus on the strength too much because, yeah, you can tell he's physically strong, but I don't think he's a big puncher. The reason I'm saying that because he punched that guy a bunch of times last night, but it couldn't get him out of there until, the, uh, I believe, like after the fourth round, the guy retired in the corner, you know what I mean, before the fifth round. Um... But is he a knockout artist? Is he a big puncher? No, I don't see that. You know what I mean? His record says otherwise that he's stopping these guys. And and, and I believe it's because of his intensity and also the fact they're picking the right opponents for this kid. This kid is fighting very soft opponents, very small opponents. You know what I mean? Nobody that's really 130 pounder, 135 pounder. And a lot of people say that, oh, that's the way the game is now and this and that. But that don't mean it's good for you. You know what I'm saying? You want to test yourself early. And the reason you want to test yourself early is because, you know what I mean, you want to know what's to be expected in the future. You know what I mean? Somebody's definitely going to hit you back and they're going to hit you back with some heavy shit. It won't be easy. You know what I mean? And um, they, they kind of paint the picture that the boxing is supposed to be easy. But the only way to become a great fighter, you got to fight other great fighters. So I don't really get why, you know, people think uh, fighting easy opponents is the way to go all the time, especially when you're trying to, you know what I mean? You're trying to build your fan base. You know what I mean? Fans don't really want to see you in easy fights every time out. That gets boring after a while. But I am who I am. He is who he is. I wish the kid, you know, much success. And um, keep doing your thing. Greg Hackett, 86 on Instagram. Greg Hackett on Facebook. Greg Hackett on Twitter. I appreciate y'all for tuning in. Thank you.